Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a brow routine. I thought I'd done one of these in the past, but I had a quick look and it doesn't look as though I've done one. Or if I did do one, it was included in a product review. And so I'm just going to do my brow routine on its own. I used to use, for my brows, I used to use the MUA Pro Brow Ultimate Eye Brow Kit in the shade Dark, which... Don't get me wrong, I do like that sort of what it looks like. Like, don't get me wrong, I do like it. There's that a bit blended out a bit more. Like, don't get me wrong, I do like it, but I've just been reaching for my Revolution Pro Brow Pomade, which I did a review on quite recently, so I will leave it in the description box below for you to check out if you want to. And I just find I've been using the brow pomade a little bit more. And that is what it looks like. So, very similar in shade. The, the brow pomade is probably a slight bit darker, but it's also that bit more pigmented. So, and I'm just going to take my flat, and I'm going to be using a flat brush for my eyebrows. But let's just get into this video. Okay, so I've tried to move in a bit further so you can see my brows a bit better. This is what they currently look like. They're not bad actually. I find I have, I prefer this eyebrow than that eyebrow just because it's got a better shape to work with. But they end up looking like almost identical sisters. So identical, almost identical twins. So yeah, I can't really complain at that. Just dipped my brush into the pomade and I'm going to grab a small mirror. I know I usually use a larger one, but I thought let's use a smaller one so you can actually see what I'm doing. I don't put too much detail into my brows because I'm fine with them the way they are. I just want them filled out a little bit more. So sometimes I shape them using a concealer, but sometimes I just leave them how they are. Let me know whether you've gone through the phase where you pretty much cut off your eyebrows and people are like really like I don't know what exactly what happened but I think it was like people could tell that I'd done like I'd messed with my brows. But have you ever done that where you've cut your eyebrows so short that you can't you can barely see them or you've shaved your eyebrows off? Because I hated my brow shape and so I think I cut it down so far that they were barely there. And now they've grown back, luckily. Because I know people do shape their eyebrows nowadays because the brow bone is so low that it's easier to shave off their eyebrows because then they can make their eyebrow higher and they can apply eyeshadow better, but yeah. I just prefer my eyebrows in the spot they are, so I'm going to leave that as they are. As you can see, they are pretty much identical sisters. That one's probably a little bit longer. So, let's try and extend. I 
I always find one eyebrow looks shorter than the other and it always tends to be that one. So let's try and make this look a little bit longer. I think I've managed to make it look longer. And then I have a spot right, well I don't have a spot but there's like a gap, or at least it looks like a gap. But those are my brows complete and obviously because it's like a powder if you do want to well not powder because it's like a pomade if you feel like it's a bit sticky which it probably does sometimes you could probably go over it with the brow powder I'm not going to but you probably could and I have actually done that before and obviously if you want like bolder brows then you could put that on and it make the colour like really there especially if you've got light brows as well and you're using a the light version of this then it might help okay now that's the end of this video if you guys enjoyed don't forget to smash a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below and leave any comments for video ideas and i'll see you guys in my next video bye